Well, crisis hit EdgeTech star Baiju's has uh, contested a decision of its shareholders to oust its founder as the chief executive officer. The company said the resolution taken at the shareholders meeting were invalid since its founders were not present. The company said at least one founder director must attend the meeting to form a valid quorum, but it was not met since neither Baiju's uh, Ravindran, his wife, nor his brother were present. The company maintains that this renders the resolutions taken at the meeting as null and void. Process NV and Peak XV partners were among the shareholders who voted to dethrone Baiju's Ravindran, indicating displeasure with the entrepreneurs and his company fights to remain in business. The outcome, however, will not be applicable until March 13th when the Karnataka High Court hears Mr. Ravindran's challenge to the validity of the meeting. The shareholders, too, are expected to present their decision before the court to justify their position. So, of course, this is the latest that is coming in as far as uh, Baiju's is concerned. This is the latest that we are learning at this point of time. My colleague Akshat Gupta joins us on the broadcast to give us more on this. Akshat, uh, what more details can you share with our viewers? Well, yes, uh, and yet another setback uh, for Baiju's. Select uh, group of investors of uh, Think and Plan, you know, which is a parent company of Baiju's, voted on and uh, basically uh, passed uh, passed a res resolution, uh, including the removal of CEO Baiju Ravindran uh, from the company and the change of the board, uh, which you know currently includes his wife and co-founder Divya Gokulnath and his brother Raju Ravindran. When the investors uh, have about you know 60% of shareholding who voted in favor of passing the resolutions to overhaul leadership and governance in the company. Uh, and they, they have also said that as shareholders and significant investors, they are confident about the validity of EGM meeting and its uh, decisive outcome. Uh, and also, uh, the tech company Baidu has termed the resolutions passed as invalid uh, and ineffective. Well, the EGM was held uh, uh, as the exec, uh, you know, major secured an interim stay uh, from the Karnataka High Court, uh, which actually said that any resolutions passed at the meeting would be contingent upon the final decision on a petition filed by the company. All right. Uh... For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon.